Well, hello everybody. RV living with the geezer. I'm here in my 22 foot Jayco that I live in full time. And uh, the other day when I went down to Weatherford to HEB, I very seldom buy red meat. And uh, their prices down there are really good. I got a, uh, what is that? A strip steak for uh, $4.73. How about that? So I'm gonna I'm gonna cook it up just in my cast iron skillet. I don't want to mess with the barbecue pit. But first, I've got my uh, onions and my mushrooms and some garlic going over here. I need to stir that around a little bit. Excuse me. Pardon my clutter here. I just wash dishes, so they're gonna they're gonna have to dry a little bit more. Yeah, get these all nice and soft. Sorry about the camera work. Yeah, got a low fire on this one here. And uh, what I'm going to do, it's lunchtime. I'm going to make a taco out of this. And then uh, just out of a little bit of it, I'm going to cut it up real thin and make like a uh, carne asada taco. And when I pull those mushrooms and onions out of my skillet, I'm going to put these jalapenos in there. And uh, roast them, uh, grill them up for a uh, for toriavos, which are roasted jalapenos, which I've showed you all before. And I didn't get the fresh mushrooms when I was in Walmart. I just got a can of these pieces and stems. Actually, there's some like sliced piece, a bunch of them in there, sliced ones. So uh, I always have too many mushrooms left over if I buy a package. And then I got these. Uh, I've had these charro beans from, I uh, haven't had the spicy ones, from H-E-B before, so I bought a couple cans of these, and I'm going to check them out here. And uh, yeah, I got my radishes cut up, which I'm hooked on lately. Uh, I got to get some more garlic. Got my Mixla tortillas. Got my really pretty cilantro that's staying nice and green, because... You put it in a little water in a mason jar in the refrigerator, and it'll stay nice for, oh, uh, 10 days or so. So, uh, yeah, now I'm going to use my hot sauce over here. And uh, let me get going here, guys, and slap this taco together and uh, show you what it looks like when I'm done. I'll be right back. All right, everybody, I'm back. And uh, I was going to save this for a Taco Tuesday. I don't know. I may just show it to you today. I'm excited about it. Uh, I got my asada, uh, my uh, New York strip steak cut up on there. I cook them medium rare. And I uh, got my grilled onions and my mushrooms on it. And my cilantro. And... You don't want to put much more than that on a steak, or I don't. Uh, I don't put cheese and all that. It, You know, you want that steak flavor. Uh, an authentic asada taco has, um, just like barbacoa, it just has the meat. It, they'll put chopped onions and cilantro, and that's it. And then I got my uh, grilled jalapeno over here, my toriado, my avocado, and my radishes. I took a taste of these spicy beans from H-E-B, and they are very good. So, uh, yeah. And look look what I got left. Look at that slab of meat. And three jalapenos and uh, mushrooms and grilled onions. So all that, I'll have that for, oh, that, that'll last me. That piece of meat will uh, go at least uh, two dinners. You know, nothing, supper, whatever you want to call it. So I can have, like I say, I don't eat red meat very often. Number one, it's not that good for you. Number two, it uh, it's expensive, real expensive. About the only time I eat red meat anymore is uh, uh, a burger at Woody's over there in Mineral Wells, because I'm not I'm not going through that town without eating a burger. But uh, yeah, let me. Real quick, we're still under five minutes. Let me sample this. 
Let me sample this Toriano and see if it's... But it just makes them real soft when you grill them like that. And I do put salt on my jalapeno. I just, I just have to. Uh, it just doesn't taste right if I don't. Let's see if it's got any heat to it. A little bit. So good that way. All right, guys. That's the geezer, and I'm going to get to eating my steak taco for lunch. And then uh, a little bit of steak for dinner. I'm a red meat guy today, I guess. Few and far between. We'll be talking to you later. Stay blessed. Stay positive. Keep your health. Adios. Bye-bye.